Okay, we're looking at Max Payne 3 on the Lenovo Yoga 13. I'm running it first here under DirectX 11. However, after the first initial be very beginning of the game when it's in the tutorial mode, uh, it crashed on that. Even though we have much better memory management here under Max Payne than we did on Grand Theft Auto 4, even though it's by the same company. So uh, I had to keep trying DirectX 11, DirectX 10, 10.1. None of them worked. They always crashed in the same spot when changing from a cutscene over to action after the first round. But here it is on DirectX 9. Runs great. Uh, you'll see right here that it renders everything fine. It looks a little jerky because I'm using a keyboard. I'm using the touchpad, not a mouse, in the keyboard. You're going to want to have, you're going to want to change from that. You're going to want to plug in a mouse to use the game or, you know, however you want to play it. The point being is that it runs great, renders, there's no lag, there's nothing here. Uh, as you can see in the background in the window, things are moving around just perfectly well. So then I decided, well, you know what, I'm going to check it again uh, in DirectX 11 because I just want to see if I can get it to work. Well, this, this cutscene or this whole scene here is after that problem I had. I haven't found and encountered it again yet to where it crashed. Direct, this is DirectX 11. Runs great. Again, everything renders perfectly. You'll see that there's no slowdown in the action of the characters. Uh, the bullets here coming up, you'll see that uh, as we fire, everything uh, works great and everything. For the advanced gamers, they're going to notice some shadowing stuff and everything. So next we're going to go to a more complex scene because as most gamers know, the more... Uh, items you have actually being rendered at the time, objects being rendered, they, it could slow down your system. So I decided to go down to this next garage scene here. And uh, this is a cut scene right now. But now we see the live action. And, and sure enough, everything, there's no slowdown. There's no problem here. Everything rendering fine. There's no jerkiness or anything. So it looks like Max Payne's a go for that. Now keep a, keep an eye on your heat and everything because uh, it could heat up your system a bit. But if you're on the road and you want to join us on Max Payne, just be aware it takes up 32 gigabytes of hard drive space. So have fun.